Time for Power Profile, sponsored by Salus Marineware. When they're moving up to extended cruising, boaters want comfort and performance on and off the water. This week on Power Profile, we check out a new Rinker 360 Express that's got all the equipment and features boaters want, and then some. So let's take a closer look. The swim platform means great cockpit access, plus a swim ladder and handheld shower for swimmers. Storage space is a mark of any great cruiser, and the 360EC has plenty in the transom and in underseat lockers. In the port side wet bar are a trash container, built-in blender, sink and faucet, ice maker and fridge. Out in the open, there's space and seating for relaxing, dining or TV, including an angled companion seat and a U-shaped aft lounge that also serves as a dinette. Overhead, the extended arch provides shelter and a place to mount antennas. Steps leading forward are another practical touch. The real nerve center of the boat, of course, is a helm station with the optional Axios joystick control system and Raymarine color radar, GPS and chart plotter. With the double wide helm seat and sport steering wheel adjusted, we're ready to head onto the water. By now, most boaters are familiar with Mercury's new Axios control system that allows for easy close quarters maneuvering with use of a single joystick. But out on the water, the Axios system also has several other unique features. For example, hit the sky hook button and the boat will automatically stay in one place, regardless of wind and weather. And when you're ready to take off and want to use one lever, hit the one lever button, pull it back and your twin engine boat can operate just like a single. Let's go. Tabs up and drives down, the 360 accelerates to 20 miles per hour in 8.7 seconds and 30 miles per hour in 14 seconds. More than respectable for a boat weighing more than seven tons. Handling in turns is also impressive. With twin 8.1 liter 496 mag Merc cruisers pushing twin prop Bravo 3 stern drives, the 360 reaches its top speed of 44.5 miles per hour at 4,600 RPM. Cruising speeds range from 24 to 32 miles per hour. And once you're underway and heading the right direction, hit auto heading and Axios takes over. There's nothing like a relaxing day on the water, especially when the skipper can sit back to enjoy it. But the 360 has just as much appeal back at the dock. The private forward cabin has plenty of storage, ventilation, luxurious fabrics, and a queen-size berth. A well-organized galley with lots of room for food and preparation is another mark of a serious cruising boat. So is a spacious, practical head and shower. An airy, open salon that does double duty for lounging and dining is also necessary, but the settee pulls out effortlessly to create a double berth. There's storage in overhead lockers, hanging lockers, and a well-concealed optional safe. The mid-cabin area is another good place to relax, with seating that also converts to a berth and no loose cushions to store. Air conditioning and heating, generator and central vac are all on the long list of standard equipment and add convenience below decks. With a 12-foot beam, plenty of headroom and lots of light, the cabin of the Rinker 360EC is always comfortable. But boaters also like to live outdoors, so Rinker's added this rumble seat. Because wherever they are, the party always ends up on the swim platform. <laughs> 